In today's highly advanced military landscape, decoys have become a central element of warfare strategy, evolving continuously to counter sophisticated detection technologies. Despite technological advancements in detection, decoy designers have maintained a competitive edge by refining and innovating to create deceptions that remain credible. The war in Ukraine serves as a powerful example of this innovation. Facing Russian forces, the Ukrainian military has deployed decoys capable of replicating not only the visual but also the thermal and electromagnetic signatures of its equipment. These are not merely tools of deception, they are force multipliers that protect troops while sowing confusion within enemy ranks. Military deception is an age-old tactic, its principles captured by Sun Tzu in The Art of War and used tactically as early as World War I with the British use of wooden dummy tanks. However, it was during World War II that decoys truly took on strategic significance. In Operation Fortitude, the Allies used inflatable tanks, fake aircraft, and misleading radio communications to convince the German command that the Normandy invasion would take place at Pas de Calais. This diversion drew German resources away from the real landing site, exemplifying the power of decoys to amplify the effectiveness of actual military operations. As reconnaissance and detection technologies evolved, so too did the complexity of decoys. With advancements in satellite surveillance and infrared technology, Modern decoys now simulate not just visual likenesses but also the thermal and radar signatures of real equipment, making them nearly indistinguishable from actual military assets. In the ongoing conflict in Ukraine, decoys have become an essential aspect of defense. Ukrainian forces have deployed decoys that range from inflatable replicas of HIMAR systems to wooden dummies of military equipment. Companies like Inflatech and Metinvest supply these decoys, which cost under $1,000 but force Russian forces to expend costly munitions on fake targets, preserving Ukraine's actual military assets. For example, in September 2023, satellite images revealed a painted outline of a Russian Tu-95 MS bomber on a Russian airbase, underscoring that both sides have adopted decoy tactics to deceive the other. The use of decoys has demonstrated psychological effects on the battlefield as well. By deploying multiple fake targets, the Ukrainian forces generate constant uncertainty within Russian ranks, undermining the reliability of their intelligence and causing miscalculations. These tactics do not merely distract, they create a fog of war, making it difficult for the Russian command to distinguish between real and simulated capabilities. Additionally, these decoys allow Ukrainian forces to exploit enemy errors, drawing attention to secondary targets while maneuvering real units into favorable positions. This asymmetric tactic enables Ukraine to counterbalance its numerical and technological disadvantages. For every decoy that draws fire, the Russian army loses both valuable munitions and time. On a larger scale, this forces logistical and financial strains on the Russian forces, as precision missiles used on decoys cost tens of thousands of dollars, while the decoys themselves cost only a fraction of that. Companies specializing in decoy production play a crucial role in modern warfare. Inflatech, a Czech company, produces inflatable replicas that can mimic tanks, armored vehicles, and even full-scale military installations. These decoys often include emitters to replicate electronic signatures, enabling them to evade radar and thermal detection. Metinvest, another supplier, produces custom replicas for materials like wood or metal, tailored to blend with the local environment and add realism to each decoy. The use of decoys has proven indispensable in modern military strategy complementing advanced detection tools and sophisticated technology. The Ukrainian conflict demonstrates that deception remains a vital skill, allowing militaries to conserve resources and inflict both economic and psychological harm on opponents. Far from being a mere tactic, military deception serves as a force multiplier, capable of adapting traditional methods to contemporary warfare requirements to maximize their effectiveness. As military technologies continue to advance, the art of deception will likely remain a central pillar of defense strategy. Future conflicts will undoubtedly see even greater sophistication in decoy technology, showcasing human ingenuity's capacity to counterbalance technological superiority on the battlefield.